Hi there, I'm Claire and I want to welcome you to another mindful moment on the OM Collective. I want to thank you for joining me today for today's manifestation meditation and allowing me into your home and space. I know that you have an endless choice of meditations to choose from, so I truly am grateful that you have chosen to join me today. And if you do enjoy today's session, one of the best things that you can do to support me and my work is to leave a positive review or share this episode and podcast with your friends and family. Something that I've been able to do all my life is attract pretty much everything that I have ever wanted into my life. Each time I write a bucket list, I continue to fulfill that bucket list. I then write another bucket list and once again, I fulfill it. It is something that I've been able to do since my very first bucket list at the age of eight years old. Now in the early years, it was definitely an unconscious thing that I could do. However, today it has definitely become more of a daily ritual and practice. If there is one truth that I know for certain, that is that the universe is here to support us all. It is here to work for us. And we are all here to co-create with the universe. We all have that power within to fulfill those wishes within. Now, I am by no means saying that it's easy because often life does have other plans for us. However, in some roundabout, magical way, we somehow always get led back to where we need to be. Yes, we may take a detour on the way. And yes, things may work out differently how we planned. And yes, we may change our dreams along the way as our inner self evolves and grows. But if we choose to be open to whatever comes our way, we will always be led to where we need to go. So with that in mind, today I invite you to join me for a meditation on creating more abundance within life. We are going to be manifesting something that you want to attract in life. So if you need a moment to pause me and think about what you actually want to attract into your life, then do so now. So now that you have an idea of something that you want to attract, I want you to find a comfortable position that can be sitting in a chair, it can be laying down. Just don't get so comfortable that you fall asleep. So I want you to settle in. Take a few big, easy breaths. Find that stillness within. Now before we journey in today's meditation, I want to share with you a quote that I have on my wall. It was a quote that I was introduced to during my yoga teacher training. And to this day, I believe it still sums up the magic of co-creating with the universe perfectly. Reminding us that we don't attract what we want, but we do attract what we are. So the quote is by Patanjali. And Patanjali wrote, quote, when you're inspired by some great purpose, some extraordinary project, all your thoughts break their bonds. 
your mind transcends limitations. Your consciousness expands in every direction and you find yourself in a new, great and wonderful world. Dormant forces, faculties and talents become alive and you discover yourself to be a greater person by far than you ever dreamed yourself to be." Unquote. So let's begin today's practice by taking a scan of the body. This will allow us to check in with the body and release any stress, tension, negativity, expectation, judgment and so forth. We will start with the top of the head. Soften your forehead and allow your ears to drop down and soften. Allow the space behind the eyes to relax. Soften your jaw and bring a gentle smile to your lips. Relax the neck and shoulders. Soften the front of your chest and allow it to expand and receive. Soften the back of your shoulders as you let them slide down your back. Feel your arms become long and heavy. Hands unclenched and fingers soft. Now slip your awareness down to your stomach, pelvis and hips. Feel them soften and relax. Let the hips release any tightness. Feel the ground beneath you, supporting you, nurturing you, grounding you. Feel the body falling into a deep relaxation and feel the stillness within you rise. Allow the back to relax and soften and let the tension and negativity just simply melt away. Drop your awareness to the top of your thighs. Soften and relax. Let calmness just slide down your legs all the way to your feet. Allow the feet to become heavy and relaxed. Toes are soft. Invite your body to surrender and let go. Now bring your attention to your breath. Feel it energize the body 
as you inhale through your nose. As you exhale, let all that is heavy and weighing you down to simply be released. And with each breath that you take, you feel lighter, freer, and more at ease. Take a moment to tune into your internal energy. How is it feeling? Is it high and fast? Or is it low and slow? Try and raise your energy. As you breathe, Imagine a moving ball of white light rolling up the base of your spine and out the crown of your head. There is so much energy that is flowing from you that this ball now becomes a continual stream of white light. This white light is now getting bigger and bigger. It is now streaming to every part of your body. It's expanding out of your body and into the universe around you. With each breath, you feel more relaxed. With each breath, your energy vibration is raising higher. With each breath, you're becoming more connected to the universe around you. Feel yourself expand. Feel the connection and natural rhythm of the universe gently hum through your body. Feel yourself becoming one with all that surrounds you. In this relaxed state, you are receptive. You are allowing and you will receive. In your mind's eye, hold a vision of what you want to attract into your life. See the vision clearly. Hold a vision of who you want to be.
really take some time in this moment to feel what it feels like to have this vision manifest. Set aside any negative self-talk that may be coming up for you now. Believe that you do have the power to co-create with the universe. See all your desires float to you naturally. Let the visions come forward. Let them expand. In these visions, allow yourself to become all that you are meant to be. You are limitless. You have the potential to do anything. You are here to become the best version of you. With each passing moment, the thing that you seek is coming closer to you. Bring your awareness to your breath. And as you breathe, focus on the good. Focus on what is great about your life. As you exhale, let go of negativity, judgment, and the need to be in control of all outcomes. Let go of any thoughts of what's missing in your life. Use this moment to set your intention on how you can be more kind to yourself and others. Breathing gratitude. Breathing good intentions. It's in this space of positivity, kindness and gratitude that abundance flows easily. It is within this positive space that the universe will serve you up synchronicities, opportunities and the right people. Attracting abundance is something that needs to be practiced daily. For unfortunately, we live in a world that is so focused on achieving, striving and competing with others. And it's easy to get lost in all the trappings 
of the modern world. It's easy to lose that high vibration connection that allows us to co-create with the universe. Now staying present and focused on your breath, I want you to take a moment and think of ways that you can start living with more intention and by adding more positivity and higher vibration to your day. Some of the things that you may want to consider are number one, take some time to slow down and feel your breath. Connect with your body and spirit through meditation or yoga. For a daily practice, it will help ground and align you with your own true nature and inner wisdom. Number two, step into an intentional loving space where you drop all self-entitlement and self-importance. Move into a place of just truly wanting to serve something far greater than your ego. Number three, release negativity by actively working towards healing any resentment, anger, sadness, bitterness, and helplessness that you may have about your own life. Choose to empower yourself by choosing to practice gratitude and focusing on what you do have and what you can do. Number four, take some time to get to know your true nature. Remove your armor and stop needing any validation from outside influences and get to know the core of who you really are. What are your ethics and values? What is important to you? What lights you up? Who do you want to become? What is it that you have come to do in this world? Or how can you spread joy, love and inspiration to others? Number five, get really, really clear on what it is that you want to attract into your life. This is the time to really dare to dream big. Knowing that if you can dream it, you can definitely make it happen. After all, we are infinite beings living in an infinite world with infinite possibilities. Number six, live each day with joy, authenticity, humbleness, kindness, and love in your heart. Be of service for something bigger than you. Become a beacon of hope, inspiration, and light for others. Number seven, Surrender the need to control the perfect outcome. Be at peace with the here and now. Accept this moment exactly as it is. And most importantly, with grace, learn to let go all that is not meant for you. Number eight. Practice patience, grace, detachment, and an open heart. Welcome openly 
whatever flows into your life. When you live with love, gratitude and abundance in your heart, nothing that is meant for you ever passes you by. We are all guilty from time to time of allowing ourselves to get into such a frenzy when we miss opportunities, rehash on past mistakes, or believe that we are not in the place that we think we should be. Know that what is meant for you will never go unmissed. Yes, you may miss the cues and the opportunities the first few times. However, once you have reconnected back to your own true nature and start living from a space of intention, the clues and adventures and opportunities, they just keep showing up. So get in the habit of just being, just allowing, and just accepting. For it is from this space that abundance flows freely and dreams are manifested. Bringing your attention to your breath and your body. And as you breathe, notice the stillness around you. Allow yourself to fill with a deep sense of stillness and peace. Be present, be still and be calm for all is well and all is at peace. Gently bring your attention to your surrounds the smells and the sounds. Reawake your body by gently rocking your head or rolling your shoulders. Maybe take your hands over your head and take a full body stretch. When you're ready, Wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes, and gently open your eyes. Thank you for listening. Now make sure that you do subscribe to this podcast so that you can hear the next meditation as soon as it drops in. Until next time. Stay well, stay safe, namaste.